Uh, hello everyone, it's a Soviet bear and right now I'm going to tell you why we are not using the best of our forces in Syria why we are using old Mi-24P hind helicopters instead of newer Mi-28N or K-52 helicopters here are a few reasons why reason number one is that Mi-24 hind it is a battle proven war tested and tried helicopter which has proven itself in in many wars such as in Afghanistan in both Chechen wars and in South Ossetia war 2008 and it also has proven itself very well in Middle Eastern hot climate and desert conditions the K-52 hasn't been tested in such conditions yet so so another advantage of the Mi-24 Hind is that it has it, it was designed as a flying IFE and uh, it has a considerable passenger section. Mi-28 section is not as big and K-52 doesn't have such sections at all. So it, it so it is very useful if you need to evacuate pilots of a shot down bomb aircraft or just crash in accident so you can evacuate them easily so another reason is its armament Mi-24P Hind has one twin barreled GSH-30K gun and six suspension points for guided and unguided missiles and four for external fuel tanks so we can you know suspend two external fuel tanks and four and four pods with guided and unguided missiles MI-28 only has four suspension points four pylons K-52 has six suspension points as well as Hind but as I said before, it hasn't been tested and in the Middle Eastern conditions. And according to some data, the guided missiles for K-52 are still undergoing some tests. Some tests, yeah. Well, of course, uh, Mi-28N and K-52 have much better, they are more advanced and they have much better air-to-ground capabilities, much better targeting systems than Mi-24. But for some reason, the Russian Ministry of Defense and the Russian Aerospace Forces Command decided to deploy all the battle-proven gunships rather than new. Well, and, of, and since... Uh, ISIS and Al-Nusra and other terrorists, they are not using man pads a lot, so I think this decision is right. So that is all guys, Soviet bear out.